there's a lot of online vector converters, but the majority of them require sign up and subscription. One of the last fully free is VTracer. However, VTracer isn't always up to par with its competitors. So how can we maximize the capabilities of VTracer for vector conversion? I'll demonstrate with this simple logo that I need vectorized. The logo is in a small resolution and has a lot of JPEG compression artifacts. Open Chrome and go to visioncortex.org slash vtracer. If we grab this image and toss it into vtracer, you can see that the results are far from optimal. vtracer doesn't interpret well the fuzzy pixelated nature of this image and its compression artifacts. So how can we improve this result? We'll get help from an amazing software called Upscale. Upscale is an open source image upscaler, which I've covered in a previous video. You can download it from their website, upscale.org download. So I'll drag our image here, choose the digital art model and upscale it. You can see that our upscale looks much better than the original image. We're gonna drag this new image into VTracer. You can see how much better this result is. It's still not 100% perfect, but the shapes are much more defined and far closer to what we expected originally. You can improve this result further by playing with the parameters here. Let's compare our results. There's definitely progress by using Upscale in this workflow. By combining these two apps, which are completely free, we achieved a result that's very competitive with its commercial alternatives. And that's one of the primary goals of this channel, to help you get the most of software that's available for everyone to use. Thanks for watching.